picked up a bottle of this Buck Shack Red Blend at Bucky's, big gas station Bucky's, what an awesome place. And uh, it was just on a center display. I liked how the bottle looked. Kind of has this funky little look, bourbon aged, uh, aged in bourbon barrels, stuff like that. Pretty good marketing. The story on the back is pretty interesting. And this is about, like they turned, basically they made a cool bar man shed out of an old buck skinning shack on their hunting property and just blah, blah, blah. I just liked it for the bottle. It was about 18 bucks, which I think is, uh, it is what it is. It's just a red blend. There's nothing great about the wine. It's not organic or anything like that. It's just a red blend to me like any other red blend. But I do like the marketing. I like the bottle. I think it makes a pretty cool just bring over to dinner type of gift, especially if you're going to like a barbecue or a cookout or something like that. Or maybe a hunting trip where you know you're going to be doing up some steaks and want to bust out some red wine with some steaks. This would be a good bottle for something like that. I just think it makes a nice little nice little gift bottle. So that's why I picked it up. Would I buy it again just for the pure quality of the wine? No, it wasn't that great, but for a little gift, and especially uh, I just saw this at a Bucky's gas station, which is a big cool gas station if you've never been there, with a huge wine selection. I know it sounds funny, but it actually has a pretty good wine selection at some pretty decent prices. And this looked like a fun, interesting bottle I hadn't seen before, so I picked it up. Anyway, if you're looking for a last minute gift or something like that, I would recommend it. If you're looking for some good red wine, I would not necessarily recommend this for $18. Anyway, like the video, subscribe, comment, all that good stuff, and have a wonderful day.